Oh, what joy for those whose sin is forgiven, whose disobedience is put out of sight. Yes, what joy for those whose record the Lord has cleared of guilt, whose lives are lived in complete honesty. With hope and faith, then, let us confess our sins together before our forgiving God. Let us pray. God, we have sinned against you. We have spoken against you and your servant Jesus. We have uttered lies. We have cursed you and others. We have said vulgar things. We have been bitten with a venom of hatred in our world. We have oppressed the helpless. We have been intolerant of others. We have delighted in violence. We have spent money foolishly. Please, Lord, God, forgive us our transgressions that we may be healed of our sin. Amen. At one time, we thought of Christ merely from a human point of view. How differently we know him now. This means that anyone who belongs to Christ has become a new person. The old life is gone. A new life has begun. All of this is a gift from God who brought us back to himself through Christ. In Jesus Christ, then, we are forgiven. You know, as the peace of God is passed amongst those that you are worshiping with this morning, or between you and me, as you see me on the screen, let's share the steadfast love of God and community with each other. The peace of Christ be with you all.